Today I am experimenting with the OPZ and trying out previously unused functionality. How much fun can one person have with this tiny remote control? Let's find out. Oh, that's beautifully dirty. This distortion is very, very good. Let me show you the OPZ distortion effect. So I'm going to remove FX1, which is the delay, and FX2, which is distortion. Okay, let's just add the distortion. So the distortion is set on FX track 2, it's effect type number 2, and you can dial it in using the green dial. Let's make the bass a bit louder so it's more obvious. That's a bit too much distortion there. That sounds great, doesn't it? What we had here is we emphasised some of the notes. So the original ones didn't have much distortion, and then we increased it a lot here and here. Let me just show you real quick what that sounds like with different effects. This is Bit Crush. And then two different types of reverb. I've loaded new samples onto the drum tracks, which has enabled a new workflow, and I can now live record a kick and snare pattern on one track. My drum kits are all loaded on slot 8. My drum kits on the kick and snare drum tracks include an array of drums from kicks and snares to hi-hats and cowbells. Drum kits are made up of a single sample 12 seconds long, and splitting that across two octaves, or 25 keys on the OPZ, means you have a little under an average of a half a second for each sound. This is the set of samples that I have on the kick and snare track. Common to both kick and snare is the hi-hats on the last three keys. There are some differences. These reverse samples are only on the kick track. On the snare track, we have a few tuned toms to make tom fills easier to enter. As cymbals in general ring out for longer than half a second, I haven't added samples for every note. And there's nothing else. 
I'm using the synth bass sound I made on Arturia's Mini V Mini Maug emulation. Click or tap the link to see the video I made on how to do that. I've added portamento to the bass track by holding track and dialing it in on the red dial. Here's a lot. Obviously that's not usable. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe.